It was our dog's birthday, and we forgot to buy a gift for our cat. So we decided to make things right. Today we learned the hard way that if it's one of your kids' birthdays, it is also the other kid's birthday. That's so cute! I love how they celebrate their pet's birthdays like that. That's adorable! Aww! That's adorable! Taking her on like a little day out to like the pet store, get a, you know, like take, they're technically shopping. It's our version of like clothes shopping. But for animals. <laughs> That's so cute. I actually really enjoyed watching that as well because I see a lot of people take their cats out in those like little stroller things and on like leads and stuff. I think mine would have my hand off if I tried to put a harness and lead on it. The cat gets gifts from the grandparents as well. Adorable. That's one impressive toy collection as well. Whoa. This cat is treated like an absolute queen. I love that video. Squash those rumors of people saying, oh, you don't spoil the cat, you just spoil the dog. Well, that's a big lie, isn't it, after watching that? Even my cat doesn't get spoiled like that. Wow, <laughs> it's made me think twice. I'm like, maybe I should be doing more. Maybe. <laughs> so cute. The way the cat's looking up, like genuinely like, where's mine? Like, where's my present? <laughs> that's so sweet. The dog's little birthday hat as well, and he's got like a little, I don't know what they're called, it's like a scarf sort of thing on. Thank you so much for watching Paws and Pets. It's goodbye from me and Flo. There you go. Good girl.